everyone, so I'm going to take you through troubleshooting with your Stripe card reader here. So first of all, if you are still unable to get the card connected or the card reader connected, let's go ahead and delete the Aesthetic Record app off of your iPad. We're going to make our way back to the App Store and re-download that. In the meantime, when we're searching for the Aesthetic Record app, we need to also make sure that we are factory resetting the card reader. And so I'm just, you'll notice here, just re-downloading that. Now, if I take this card reader, I do want to make sure that it's on. Now, you will notice near the power button here, there is a very, very small little hole. So you can take the back of an earring or a paper clip. You're just going to insert that, you know, directly into the device. When you insert that paper clip or the back of an earring, you can hold that for about five to 10 seconds. And once you reset that, you will see some flashing colors on your device. You'll notice that it turns back blue. And so that occurs after you do that factory reset. So now we're gonna go back to the Aesthetic Record app. Go ahead and enter in your login details. All right, so once we get logged in here, in order to get this card reader paired up this one time, let's go ahead and click the blue button on the bottom, click the credit card, we'll choose a patient. Go ahead and just choose any profile or if you have like a test profile, that's ideal. And so at this point in time, I'm just going to add a custom amount in. So if I just wanna do something for a dollar, because we do want to actually run a credit card transaction at this time. So I'm going to add that into the cart, click check out. All right, so this is the important message right here. So in order to get that card reader connected, we have to click allow. So we're going to go ahead and select allow. Now we're going to go ahead and choose card, swipe card, charge. And at this point in time, this is going to connect to the device. And you will notice the device will start to, you know, shuffle between like a white or a purple color and a blue. So once we get this message right here, swipe, insert, or tap, go ahead and insert your credit card into the card reader. You'll notice on the very top here, we do have the way to insert a chip. And then on the back side here as well, there's the ability to swipe a card through this. So you can swipe or insert the chip, and then there is also the ability to do the tap to pay. So go ahead and do that, and once you do that, that will connect this card reader to your app. I do highly recommend that you keep one iPad connected to one card reader, so whether you need to put a little sticker on the back of your card reader that says, you know, iPad one, card reader one, we do recommend pairing up a device with the card reader um, just so that that connection doesn't have to reoccur. So this is the first or the only time that we'll really have to do this connection. Once we do this connection, you will be all set to go. So let us know if you have any questions at all, and we are happy to help. Have a great one.